Hello everyone, this is Victory Gaming Dragon, playing Seven Days to Die. Today we're trying out a new mod, it's called Crystal Hell. The name of my game, I called it Crystal Hell Nomad. It's going to be a random world gen. I called it Crystal Hell. C is capitalized in Crystal, there's a space, and H is capitalized in Hell. I think we'll go with a 6k map. And the generated world is called Gozitiho Go Go County. Okay. Difficulty. I'm going to try out Nomad. Basics. All default. Blood Moon. I'm going to try 16 for now. See how it goes. Multiplayers. All default as well. I just keep it at. Like, uh, claim block stuff. That really doesn't matter for us. So let's go ahead and start the game. Okay, we got some tooltips here. Crystals are littered throughout the world. Harvest them for materials or stand by them for unique buffs. All right, what's number two? Traders may be reluctant to speak to you at first. By doing quests and leveling up your questing skill to level one, you may start to trade with them. Classes, there are three classes for you to choose from. Assassin, Brute, and Marksman. You can only choose one, so be careful which you pick. By leveling the class weapons, the game will auto-assign your class for you. Alright, number four. Assassins are quick hitting and high damage dealing. They specialize in stealth, but have lower health than the rest of the classes. Play this class if you prefer the snipers, knives, and bows. Brutes are slow, but make up for it by being able to take a beating and output decent damage. Play this class if you prefer shotguns, clubs, sledgehammers, and brawler, which I assume means fist weapons. Marksmen are devastating at any kind of range. Moderate health and moderate speed make them a good overall choice. Play this class if you prefer machine guns, pistols, and spears. Biomes have different effects based on which one you decide to get into, so decide wisely and prepare. Finally, number eight. Skill points are no longer a thing. You level up your weapons naturally by using them and unlock skills passively by doing so. Welcome to the Crystal Hell mod. This is the OOG show's first official mod release. Be careful as you progress through the world. Some biomes are more different than others, so be careful which ones you are traveling through. The calming energy of the forest surrounds you. Well done, Survivor. You've done well so far. You still have not proven yourself worth, worth our time yet. Come to one of our settler settlements and we'll give you a basic task to do. We'll be waiting. Okay, so journey to settlement, locate trader. It's very close. So some buildings in the distance. Well, we need to head south. About this mod. This mod was meant to retain the feel of vanilla seven days to die while adding much, much more and expanding the end game quite a bit. It doesn't take much to see that the world has fallen to shit. It's become normal to blow the head off a human or what used to be a human in order to survive and even thrive in the undead world. This time though, you get to uncover the secrets to why you're here. Look for clues that are hidden deep in undead hives and overran military outposts, or from your friendly traders who have seen it all. Fight the undead as the biome shapes them and the radiation makes them stronger over time. If you're a hardcore player or a casual player looking for a twist, this mod is for you. It won't be easy as you learn where you can step and where you can't, but through time, you will learn that you will conquer. I hope to see you among the living fighting side by side with survivors and against bandits. Good luck out there, survivor. Godspeed. List of features. Custom boss battles with boss abilities, different every time you fight them. Multiplayer tested and ready for you and your friends. They also need the mod to play. World bosses that skulk around the world waiting for you to challenge them. Deadly biome effects could kill you if you're unprepared. Rework traders. No longer are traders a one-stop shop. Action skills. Go from level 1 to 500 and gain massive benefits along the way. Traders are destructible. Be careful when you go to do training as you may find a wandering horde has broken in. New weapons and items. New crafting recipes. New crafting stations. Zombies completely redone. Zombies now get much, much harder depending on which biome you go into, so be careful. 
Decoration blocks. Crystals spawn all over the world. Break them and have a chance at getting good loot. Zombie hives. Find hives around your random gen or crystal hell dedicated map. Loot these POIs and get fantastic loot. Be careful though. Some of the worst zombies of that biome hide in the shadows. Defeat them and unearth the secrets they hold. New biome bosses. Go through the trader quests and unlock boss battles. Storyline. Dive into the story of why you're here and how the world became an undead wasteland. Wandering survivors and bandits. See someone else in your world? Chances are they are a survivor or a bandit. Approach with caution. Expanded gameplay. The aim of the mod is to stretch the gameplay to make the playability of a world much larger. Three new block pass steel. Tungsten, titanium, and quantanium, or quantium. It says all shapes included. Food spoils. Be careful where you store it and what you keep. So your food will spoil over time. You can craft from containers. Make sure you're within 10 blocks of the chest you want to pull from. Farming overhauled, multiple new plants to either protect your base or give you bonuses. Skills redone. You will be put into a class based on what weapons you decide to use. All right, there we go. <clears throat> so, after reading all that, we now know that there are some very interesting things to know about this uh, mod. So if we find crystals, we want to break those. Find a bunch of stumps to break, but I haven't gotten any honey yet. Oh, I see a chicken. Oh, I see a zombie as well. Let's see, we only have a 10 slot tool belt. I lost the chicken. Okay, I've played for like 20, 30 minutes. So the first thing I realized is, look how small the zombies are. <laughs> like, what's going on here? He's like mini-sized. But he's got red or uh, yellowish red eyes. So that is a feral. So our first zombie has 328 health and is a feral. Also, I noticed when I hit him, it sounds like you're hitting metal. Which is a little odd. Okay, there's a crystal. There's the first one. We want to break that for materials. Uh, I know it said something about if you're using a certain weapon, it like picks your class automatically for you. Um, I'm not really worried about what class I get. Repair that. I kind of want to be using bows like right off the bat, but I don't have feathers. But if I find that chicken, I can kill it and get feathers. But I don't know where he went. Oh, wait, there he is. Okay. Come here, chicken. Don't you run away. Need those feathers. Lose all my stamina chasing you and won't be able to attack. Okay, we got you. We got you. No, no, no. Gotcha. Cool. I like you start out with a bone knife. That helps out quite a bit. Oh, we actually got an egg from him, too. And leather. Huh. Kind of weird. Eggs and leather from a chicken. All right, from a banana, and then I don't know. Do these heal you? No, they don't heal you. Okay, so bandages only are good for stopping bleeding. So we'll go ahead and put that on our bar. So this meter indicates like how long it will last, and then it becomes. Unedible, I guess. Let's see, stone. I want arrows. Stone. Why can't I make a stone arrow? Oh, I have to make arrowheads and shafts. Okay. Get rid of this stuff. I know there's something I probably should read. Let's see. Something about this stuff. Quantum elevator panels. Okay, that's about like an elevator. It's fine. I don't need to read that right now. Read it off camera. Okay, I already read that. And then something about the farms. There's like special seeds. And think, wait, no, this is 
This is somewhat about that. Craft the hot box to research and improve your seeds with a variety of special traits. Bonus, further doubles crop yield, four times yield over unmodified crops. Explosive, triggers a concealed explosive when stepped on, struck with a melee weapon, or hit with an arrow. Due to flexible nature of plants, the detonator will not trigger if struck with bullets or other explosives. Fast plant research maturity in half the time. Renewable. Clean fresh water allows the plants, this plant to spread out its roots and produce crops endlessly. Thorny. Integrates with sharp metal thorns. Touching them will cause one to bleed. Underground. Fused with mushroom DNA, allowing growth without need of, for sunlight. Alright, that's pretty weird, but okay. Oh, we got one feather. Wow. Okay, so how do we make... Okay, stone arrow head. Okay, we can just turn stones on that. Oh, I already got a ton. All right, let's try like 50. And what was it, a shaft? Shaft? Wooden arrow shaft. I need a stick. How do I get a stick? <laughs> okay, I make wood in the sticks. Okay, I said I did 50. Okay. So yeah, we got to do a little bit of extra crafting to get a bow going. But I didn't make a bow, like, right off the bat. Uh, what is that? What is that? Rabbit? Yeah, it's a rabbit. Give me a rabbit! Tricks are for kids! Stop it! Oh, I gotcha. I gotcha. No, no! I thought I had you. Yeah! <laughs> Son of a... It was... It was jumping! Look how crazy this rabbit is. Come on can't hit you. Oh, I'm out of stamina. I hate you. Tricks rabbit. I don't even know where it went. Well, anyway. Oh, there he is. It would probably be a lot easier to hit him with a bow. Okay, now can we make stone arrows? Make. Oh, I can make charred meat. Okay. Stone arrow, right? Okay, stone arrows. Oh, it makes... Wait a minute, now it's too much. I don't need that much stuff. Wait, wooden sh Okay, recipe, wooden shaft. Oh my god, I need too many. That's okay. I didn't know the multiplier. Oh, we got a book. Looks like an archery book. Exploding arrows. Okay, cool. Explosive arrows. Ooh, got some glue. I should make some padded armor as soon as possible. That's a that's another little feral guy, but he's got less health than the last dude, so we'll probably just go ahead and kill him. I'm trying to not kill zombies unless they're low health, because like we have really no way of to heal ourselves, so yeah. That's another thing that happens when they they're so small. Like, their necks will get stretched out. It's quite weird looking. Okay, I don't want to get hit. I don't know if they're slow because they're small or what. That's kind of funny. Oh, and our XP meter goes down. But, like, it shows the number and it lowers as we kill. The red bar goes up. Okay, die? Yeah, his neck got all stretched out. It's funny. Alright, we got a couple zombies over there. He's aware of me. Tree, mountain, pine, dry, 21 meter. Yeah. Tells me what kind of tree it is. Oh, you're a little girl too. But you're a normal zombie, right? Okay, do we have arrows yet? I need to make arrows. Wooden arrow shaft. We got that. Stone. I feel like she's getting close to me. Stone arrows. We can finally make those. Now I want all. There we go. 24. Okay, load me up. How much damage does that do? Oh my god, don't miss. Not much. Oh my god, arrows suck. Oh, 
I mean, the knife was doing like 40 a hit with the power attack, I think. Oh no! There's a fast radiated! What the? Okay. I want my arrows back at least. <laughs> he's uh, he's like a normal size, so he's running quick. Okay, maybe I can just lure him away. That's no bueno. Yeah, come, come chase me. Yeah, this is why I'm not playing on like a harder difficulty, because I know just from playing for 30 minutes that there was like random hard zombies. Like, I found a zombie with like 900 health right off the bat. And I was like, nope, we're not playing on hard difficulty. No, thank you. Okay, let's go back over here. Hopefully he loses track of me. Okay, where'd you go, girlfriend? Shorty zombie. And also, I want to make sure I find a nice home right off the bat early on. And we'll start living in there. So it's probably going to be like the first POI we clear, or we can try to find um, a good marble home or brick home. Marble. I meant co cobblestone. <laughs> What's this? Spear level two. Okay. Oh, that's another thing. I could probably... Yeah, I could make a spear. That might help. A bit of a, a knife. A bone knife. Okay. Sounds like metal every time I shoot him. It's just kind of weird. Can you leave me alone? I don't want to fight you. I keep shooting right through you. I don't understand that. Gotta shoot like... Point blank. Can you leave me alone? Here, run over here and get stuck on the slower zombie. Okay, we got you. Okay, I just want to grab my arrows. Oh, she already disappeared, so my arrows are all over the floor. Go away. Ah, you bitch. Give me my arrows. Oh! My precious arrows! I just want my arrows back. Alright. We're going in there. We're going for it. Alright, give me that. How much did he hit me for? Like 10? Oh, not even. Oh, I regenerate. Oh, I regenerate quicker than I thought. Look at that. That's nice. Okay, well that makes up for that. What is this? Like bushes? Oh, they give me wood too. Oh, they're like, they're like these. Just more leafy. This is like a bad area of town, apparently. Cash money! I don't know if... I'm guessing we run on Dukes, not old cash in this mod. Okay, I can sell that for a hundred. We, we already read it. We got a car! What do you got for me? A battery, hey! Okay, I need a spear. Ah! Zombies! Okay, we got a little big mama and a big big mama. Are you feral? What the? I'm gonna quick. Oh, got an ambulance. Oh, that's gonna take forever to loot, but gotta risk it. Honey! Got a book. Um, pockets? Footwear. Okay, we need to find the pocket mod. We gotta make pocket mods. What is that? Oh, they got unique POIs. I forgot about that. Cool. Okay, what's this one? Desert wear. Okay, you're fast. I don't want to fight you. Alright, let's get the spear. Alright, let's get over to our trader. See what trader we got. She's still chasing. It's a big jerk face. I need feathers. Let me move. More feathers. I need cloth. We gain farming skill. No. Like everything we do, we gain skill. And then the cap's at like 500, I believe. So we can sell that. Can I make really good stuff? Ooh, we can make barbed fence. Oh, we can make robotic ammo. 
That usually sells pretty well. Get an iron mine going early on. Just make ammo for your turret and sell it. Make some decent dukes. I have to admit, though, seems a bit laggy. Like, just a wee bit. Hopefully that's just because it's a fresh world and I just, when I leave and come back in, it'll be better. Who knows? Okay, let's try out the spear. Can we throw spears? No, it's not throwable. It's just a power attack. Okay. So, power attack. Yikes, it takes a lot of, a lot of stamina. Skill seems to gain pretty quick. Can you... Loot the mailbox? Come on. Okay, we got another sewing book. It was winter wear. Alright, what's a power attack cost me? Like 30. And then about 16 for a regular? 15? I don't know. Okay, yeah, like 15. Alright, spears are decent. I don't have to uh, get very close. Spear is increased. You have 441 health. <laughs> oh, crap! There's a dog! <laughs> okay, it didn't see me. Oh, like, yikes! Oh, they're jumping over. They're pretty smart. There's water through here so I can get water. Me my jar. I don't know if we can boil jars without a cooking pot or cans or whatever. But we'll find out. Sometimes it just takes longer. Sometimes you can't do it. I think you can do cans, though. Don't mind the radiated barrel. Did I? Oh, I can't. I can't get water with the can. That sucks. Because I need water. Hello, sir. Good, you're the little one. Doesn't look like they regenerate. I hit for two? Come on. Oh, crap. That one's getting fast. Why are you fast? You're small. The little guy. Is he a feral? Is that why? It doesn't say feral. It just gives me other health. It actually doesn't have any. Uh-oh, I'm gathering quite the group. I just wanted to kill the one guy. See, right there, I felt definitely there was a lag spike. Okay, I just want to kill the one dude. How can we separate y'all? Hmm. How about if you get stuck here? Ah! No, I just want, I want to kill the guy with 70 health. Okay, maybe if I poke the little girl. Oh, she's only got 100 health. Uh, my stamina. Okay, they're getting kind of stuck behind each other. Ah, crap! <laughs> Scared the crap out of me. He's running fast. He's got a feral eye. I almost feel like this is a uh, feral sense. <laughs> Let's dart in. Come on. Get you. Got him. Ooh, a bag. Hello. And then one of those girls is like 100 health. All right, let's grab that loot. Actually, we're going to get out of here because this is, this is too much. Iron ingots, lead trophies, and a beer. Okay, take it. So any more mailboxes we can grab along the way? Oh, look at the trader. They've got dirt walls. Oh, another book for spears. This one. Strong arm. Increased projectile speed and range. Well, there is no projectile. I don't. Maybe it reduces my uh, stamina cost when I power attack. We should probably. Yeah, see the meter's going down. The eggs actually last a little bit longer. Is my health not going up? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, it's just really slow. Oh, is it... 
I have to be out of combat and then it regenerates? Is that what it is? Okay, you got you got feral eye. But you're slow at least. Okay, we'll kill you. Oh, there's a zombie inside. Of course there is. It's be big boy tourist zombie. Yep, he's coming for me. Baker, huh? Got Baker on the outside of this place. I'm not sure what that means, other than they have food. Die! Can you die? What the? God, one health. Okay. Okay, we got anything in this nest? Two feathers. All right. We need feathers, though, badly. Okay, we got a 380 hit point. I hit for two damage? What? This is ridiculous. How can I hit for two damage? I'm gonna take like 500 swings to kill this stupid thing. I mean, my spear is going up fast. Maybe that's the point? <laughs> Alright, let me just poke you. I'm gonna run out of stamina. Well, I can backpedal. It says I'm level 17 now. So it's going up fast. Of course, I don't want to back up into a wall. Oh, there's a chicken. Uh, five. Come here! Yes, got it. These take forever to skin. Got some more eggs. I know we can eat eggs raw. Then we can grill the meat. I'm not sure once you cook the food, how long... If it has, like, a, a duration that it lasts. Or is it just forever at that point since it's cooked? You're, like, not dying. Okay. Nobody's around. Okay, our spear is already level 19, but there's 500 levels. So I imagine it gets pretty slow at some point. Okay. Let's knock you down for a minute. Let's go for the head. Another big boy. He's littler. Level 22. It's broken. Now we gotta repair. Oh, it repaired, like, instantly. Nice. But I'm attracting more zombies, which is bad. This guy's fast. This guy's got a lot less health. Well, not a lot less. A little bit less? <laughs> well, I guess you can keep out of range pretty easily on this. See, you have a hit a milestone, 2,500 XP. Oh, cause okay, every le is every level only 100 XP? Okay, you're about to die. Where did all these guys come from? Oh, there's like five. You're not helpful. I wanted to go do a. Uh, a quest and take over a POI. Oh, there's another chicken. I need to go get that. You guys stay here for a sec. Chicken. Where'd you go? There he is. Got him. Okay, how far? Yeah, they're not. Let's do power attack. Got him. Oh, that's a lot of feathers. Yes, perfect. Feeling we're gonna need a lot of arrows. Okay. First, I worked on you a little bit. You're about half. Okay, we can kill you and then we'll kick, kill the big boy. Oh wait, I don't want to use this. Kill you and the big boy and then we'll head into the trader. Hopefully we can get the zombies to go away. Oh no, another little guy. Look at him. He's so cute. Look how cute he is. All right, where's Big Boy? Are you the one I was killing? Yeah. Dead. All right. Fortunately, there's a lot of zombies nearby. Oh, 
we got more feathers. It's a pretty nice uh, random gen. Nice big town looks like to the east. Another battery, yeah, and a radiator. So there's a little bit of a town north, northwest, and then east, it looks like. Let me see how you... So I started out up here, and then... So this whole area is probably connecting with that over there. You get them off me. So how am I supposed to get in here if I want to get in here safely without the zombies chasing after me? I guess, I don't know if I can stay in here at night or not, actually. But I know it's destructible. I can get up here. Get in! Up! Up! Nah, I can't do it. Okay. Hmm. How many arrows do we have? 41? I think I need to make more arrowheads. Do we even need this right now? Running flesh. Blood bags? How do we get blood bags? 20 blood bags? Huh. <laughs> That's a little weird. Gotta learn the crafting system. I'm gonna be starving and thirsty here soon. I need... Oh, I think he should have a cooking pot. I just gotta get in here. Let me eat some eggs. Five food, two health. Or they start going bad. And then my meat's my meat's all gonna go bad. And when it stacks, it doesn't like restart the meter, so that's kinda stupid. Um, let me try I made a yeah, I made a campfire. Put that down. Um some fuel. And then we can make what is this? Oh! We can make canned food? Cool. Because we have cans? Interesting. And then charred meat. I didn't know we could do that. That seems very, in very interesting and good. How long is this going to take? I just need more cans. Hmm. Alright, can we make some padded armor? I have glue. Okay, so let's make duct tape. Or actually pocket. Pocket mod. Uh, let's see. Oh, we need sewing kits. Never mind. We can make frame shapes right off the bat. Alright, cool. Is it just one or two? Okay, I get two at a time. And this gives me food and water. Ten food, ten water, five health. Nice. Well, we're gonna need the water, so let's go ahead and eat those. And let's see what else we can make. Can I just keep making more? Hell yeah, let's make more. Wait, why is it... It's not letting me make more than one. Oh, they, yeah, these don't last forever. They have a meat or two. Alright. Well, that's fine. I'm gonna take that. So this meat is all gonna go bad. Um. I don't know. Putting in a container would stop that? Probably not. I don't know what it, it happens to it, if it just disappears or what. Oh, look, the freshage meter start, re went the full, I think. Or is that just one at a time that goes away? I forget. I don't, I don't know if it said if I had 26 or not. Okay, well. Let's wait for this to finish. Your skill in cooking has increased. Okay. So we'll go ahead and eat, drink. I need the water. 
And now... Okay, and then just leave that in there. Hmm. Okay, we've got batteries. So I guess I could sell one. Okay, I wanted to get in here real quick, but there's some freaking zombies everywhere. So, let's lead them away. Yikes! Come on. Come on, stupid. Doesn't look like we'll be doing any questing today, unfortunately. We'll probably be doing that tomorrow. we will lay low during the night. Very loot this. Yeah. Come get me. Is this functional? No. Yeah, you guys are a bit faster than the other guys. Okay, hopefully I can lose you. But there are zombies right out front. Why is that? Why are you guys hanging here? One's really slow. Maybe I'll just kill him. I'll get the fast ones out of here. But I heard you idiots. A boom LPG. <laughs> oh, oh, police station. Maybe I'll get a gun in there. Yeah, come get me. Okay, we're going to lead you guys a couple more buildings farther than the last time. Because it looks like you guys were still kind of following. Okay. Come on, fellas. You guys are the little feral-eyed fast guys. Okay, let's... I'll just run around. Hopefully get them completely lost off me. Oh, there's a little zombie here. I should be able to lose you, though. You're slow. I'm getting close to level up. Okay, there's the door. Now remember, this place can get destroyed. We got five plastic. Oh, he's got a mailbox. Another archery book, I don't know. Crippling shot, cool. Oh, there's a pot right on top of the forge. Sweet. Okay, we got that. Here's zombies. Blueberries. We've got a grill. Maybe have a cooking grill? Hell yeah, now we got a pot and a cooking grill. Glue. Okay, vending machine. What the hell is this? Bonus shovel XP? Oh, they got some, like, unique stuff. Cool. Sugar butts. Nice. Hey, buddy. Hey, jackass. Can I lighten that backpack up for you? Hey, I got your coffee. You got anything else to loot in here? What about the soda machine? Oh, red tea. Nice. Quest completed. All right. So he won't let me trade with him until I get it. something done. Do some pretty your worth. Maybe I can reconsider it. Okay. So I have to do jobs. Uh, boss hunt... Boswardo? No thanks. <laughs> um, fetch, clear. And this is the closest. If you want work from me, don't just stand. Yeah, thanks. Up your ass. Wait, what's this? That job done. Box crystal loot. Oh, and five hundred dukes. Oh, he. So when we got to him, we got some stuff. Okay. Um, let's see. Can we get in here? I'm sure we can. I just gotta break stuff. There we go. Ooh, another glass jar. Nice. Alright, what else you got? Another pot. Books. Okay, we got some books. Beverage cooler. Got some more beer. Running flesh. Get this wood. Hmm, I don't know what I want to do overnight. Like, I can't be... You know, running around, probably. Probably not a good idea. Uh, maybe we we'll just find somewhere to hide. To hide, I mean. Somewhere up high, uh... A building or something. If I can make frames, right? Frame? Yeah, I can actually make... I'll do, like, ten frames. Or... 
we can nerd pull. Why do you have rotting flesh in your oven? That's a little weird. And then we got another cooking pot. What's this? Mortician? Or It's got a hat? Cloth, rotting flesh, overalls. So that's better than what I have. We'll take it. Toss this stuff. Um, put that on my bar. Read these books. Self-defense. Don't become the prey by using these tips to stop would-be attackers. More damage to humans. That doesn't really help. Basic moves. Do 10% more damage with fist, leather, iron, and spike knuckle weapons. That probably won't be using those. Okay, there is a sink in here. Can we use it? Where is... Okay, where's my glass? Okay, sinks don't work. At least this guy's. Oh, crap. They beat down the door. <laughs> no! Ow. Just don't get infected. Okay, hopefully they don't kill traitors. He's got a bunch of corn and stuff to get. That. Ah, I gotta get out of here. Okay, this is not safe. It's like a thousand zombies. Alright, where can we go? Well, Kaboom LPG looks like a brick building. And it's right by the trader. That looks like the perfect place to hold up. I could take it over and it'll be my home. Alright, let me, uh... Let's see, go right here, maybe? Ah! What the? <laughs> you jerk! I thought it was up against the building. No, that's not... That's too far. Hold on there. Okay. We got... A zombie up there. Alright. I don't think they can get to me. Oh my god, you have 600 hit, hit points? I did three damage with my bow. Oh, crap. Go away! Alright, let's try spear. Okay, you're low. I'm just kill you. Let's, let's try to build our bow skill. Is there other zombies coming? I don't think there is. Looks like we're relatively safe for the moment. Yeah, we really need to level up the bow skill. Oh, our head just went weird. Neck. Oh, I'm 14 encumbered? Oh, crap. They found a way up! Wait, what is that? Oh, that is a zombie. I was like, there's something green there. What is that? It's a zombie! Um, this didn't work out so well. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Holy crap! Oh my god, lag! <laughs> What the hell happened? Apparently they blew up something. I'm very angry at that. Okay, I think I can get up here now. I don't know how easy it is for them to get up to me. I'm there smashing my blocks. Alright, I need to make some more frames. Uh, Ten more. So we gotta get to know our trader before he'll let us sell to him. Hmm. Look at them breaking blocks. Hey, this is supposed to be my new home. You jerks. Oh. Wrecking it. They're going inside. Hmm. Well, this is not going as I had planned. More stuff. Grills, pink. A screamer? What? Why is there a screamer? Is it because of that stuff that blew up? Seriously? 
Oh man. Okay, I need um, I need stone arrowheads, right? If I make one, is it one for one? Okay, that's kind of stupid. All right, make me forty-nine, and then I got sticks, and no, I need shafts. All right. Okay, just make all those in the shafts. They're demolishing this place. Hmm. Oh, there she is. How much health do you have? 65. Oh. You're jumping all over the place. What the hell? Uh, they must have destroyed a barrel. Let me shoot you in the head. We seem to have attracted a lot of zombies. Wait, it's nighttime. Do they not run at night? That's no, hard to tell. They're not, you know, chasing me. Oh, crap. Oh, they're destroying all the cars. It's like huge. Whoa! <laughs> that whole thing is collapsing. Wow, okay. Creating a lot of lag for me, that's for sure. There's so many zombies. I was trying to kill the stupid screamer. Now, I can't see her. Hmm. I think we better just quietly run away and hide for the night because this is just crazy. Can't really get any kills. Alright, let's run off. We'll be very quiet. Okay. I'm also very encumbered right now. Alright. Have they forgotten about me? Yeah, they're tearing down that building, that's for sure. Okay. Well, so much for that idea. I was going to be like, oh, this will be our new home. It's brick. Eh, we can find another one. Maybe we'll take over the police station. General information, our quest. It's relatively close by. Where is that? Oh, it's north. Okay. So we'll do that tomorrow once it's morning. For the night, I'll just try to be really quiet. I'll make all my arrows. Looks like I can't make any more. Actually, I'm going to go back to my campfire. Yeah, I'll go back to my campfire, see what I can make, because now I have a grill. Should be able to make, I guess, grilled meat. And I have more cans, so I can make more soup. That's pretty awesome, you can make your own canned food. Where was it? Right here? Ooh, zombie! Go away! You have 388 hit points, yeah. I don't like that. I think the lowest was like in the 150s, 160s so far. Yeah, you stay over there. There's my campfire right there. Probably should have marked it, but it's fine. I have a general idea of where to find it. Oh yeah, the police station right there. It's like concrete, I think. So that should work out. Get my soup. Oh, it's still... Oh, maybe it's just one at a time, then. Maybe that's what that is. Okay. Grill? Oh, I never put the pot in. My pots. There it is. I don't know, maybe I didn't have a pot at the time, now that I think about it. Okay, what can you make me? Oh, I used up all my... fuel, because it doesn't stop... Oh, it's locked. I need cooking mastery. Okay, well, this is good enough. Hell yeah, make me soup. 
Okay, we're going to end the video here. I'll be just hanging out. So thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please make sure you like the video and you are subscribed. And I'll see you in the next one for more Crystal Hell. Bye.